Brought to you by wikivd.com Joe Thornton Joseph Eric Thornton is a Canadian professional ice hockey centre and an alternate captain for the San Jose Sharks of the National Hockey League. He was selected first overall by the Boston Bruins in the 1997 NHL entry draft and went on to play seven seasons with the club. Three as its captain. During the 2005-06 season, he was traded to the Sharks. Splitting the campaign between the two teams, he received the Art Ross and Hart Memorial trophies as the league's leading point scorer and most valuable player, respectively. Thornton's on ice vision, strength on the puck, deft passing ability, and power forward style of play have led to him becoming one of the league's premier top line centers. Listed at six foot four and 220 pounds, he has received the nickname Jumbo Joe. Amateur career Thornton grew up playing minor hockey in his hometown of St. Thomas, Ontario, for the St. Thomas Travelers. He played hockey for the Travelers, and in Pee Wee won an Ontario Minor Hockey Association Championship in 1992-93. His Bantam year was the first for the newly created AAA Elgin Middlesex Chiefs organization and Thornton joined the AAA Elgin Middlesex Chiefs of the Minor Hockey Alliance of Ontario for the 1993-94 season. The creation of this organization led to the St. Thomas Minor Hockey Association to compete at the A level. During his Bantam year, he appeared in six games for the Junior B Street. Thomas Stars of the Ontario Hockey Association, scoring eight points in six games as a 14-year-old. The following season, Thornton joined the Stars full-time and reeled off 104 points over 50 games as a 15-year-old, and was subsequently drafted second overall in the 1995-0 draft to the Sault Ste. Marie Greyhounds behind Daniel Tikachuk, who was selected by the Barry Colts. Beginning in 1995-96, Thornton began a two-year career in the Ontario Hockey League with the Greyhounds. He posted a 76-point season in his first year, earning both All and CHL Rookie of the Year honors. The following season, Thornton improved to 41 goals and 122 points, second overall in league scoring behind Mark Savard of the Oshawa Generals, and was named to the All Second All-Star team. Boston Bruins, 1997-2005 after his second all season, Thornton was selected first overall in the 1997 NHL entry draft by the Boston Bruins. Thornton suffered a fractured arm in the Bruins' preseason, but made their roster for the 1997-98 campaign. He scored his first career NHL goal on December 3, 1997, in a 3-0 win against the Philadelphia Flyers. Head coach Pat Burns was measured in his deployment of Thornton, using him almost exclusively on the fourth line and making him a regular healthy scratch, averaging 8 minutes and 5 seconds of ice time per game over the course of the season. He registered three goals and seven points in 55 games as a rookie. In the 1998 Stanley Cup playoffs, Thornton went scoreless in six games. In 1998-99, Thornton saw significantly more ice time, averaging 15 minutes and 20 seconds per game, and improved to 41 points in 81 games, as well as a 9-point effort in 11 playoff games. Thornton continued to build into a key player in the Bruins' lineup, increasing his points total in each of the following two campaigns. Prior to the 2002-03 season, he was named team captain, succeeding Jason Allison, who was traded to the Los Angeles Kings in 2001. The captaincy position was vacant for a full season after Allison's departure. In his first season as team captain, Thornton recorded 68 points over 66 games. The following year, he notched his first career 100-point season with 36 goals, a career high, and 65 assists. He ranked third in NHL point scoring, behind Peter Forsberg of the Colorado Avalanche and Marcus Naisland from the Vancouver Canucks. 
Thornton's production declined to 73 points in 77 games in the 2003-04 campaign. He suffered a fractured right cheekbone in a fight with New York Rangers centerman Eric Lindros. During a game on January 19, 2004, the two power forwards fought after Lindros cross-checked Thornton in the head. The injury required surgery, keeping him out of the lineup for three games. The 2003-04 campaign also saw a drop in Thornton's goal-scoring production that has never since rebounded. His last 30-goal season came during the 2002-03 season. H.C. Davos and trade to San Jose Sharks, 2004-05 after his production decreased to 73 points over 77 games in 2003-04, Thornton went abroad to play for HC Davos of the Swiss National League A due to the 2004-05 NHL lockout. He played on a line with fellow NHL players Rick Nash and Nicholas Hagman, helping HC Davos to a league championship and Spengler Cup win. Since then, Nash and Thornton keep a close contact to Arno Del Curtu and H.C. Davos. Thornton returns every summer to train for up to a month with the club, with the NHL set to resume in 2005-06. Thornton became a restricted free agent in the summer of 2005 and was reportedly unhappy with the state of the Boston Bruins franchise, as well as the criticism of his play in the Bruins' early playoff exit in 2004. Thornton was under heavy scrutiny for his leadership style and was criticized for being unable to raise his level of play during the playoffs. Many people felt that Bruins head coach Robbie Futterek gave Thornton the captaincy too early. Regardless, Thornton re-signed with the team on August 11, 2005 to a three-year deal worth $20 million. While Thornton was off to a strong start production-wise, the Bruins were struggling in the standings. On November 30, 2005, Thornton was traded to the San Jose Sharks in a four-player deal, which sent forwards Marco Sturm and Wayne Primo and defenseman Brad Stewart to Boston in exchange. For the Bruins captain, Thornton was the team's leading scorer at the time, by a substantial margin. Then Bruins general manager Mike O'Connell later stated in a June 2011 interview that he would still make the trade, and that it was satisfying to see Boston win a Stanley Cup before Thornton's San Jose Sharks did. O'Connell further explained the trade by questioning Thornton's character both on and off the ice. At the time, contrasting him with Patrice Bergeron, who was in his second full season with the Bruins when the trade took place, O'Connell recalled making the decision with assistant general manager Jeff Gorton to alternatively build the team around Bergeron. Thank you for watching. Brought to you by WikiVD.com. Please like and subscribe below. Please like and subscribe below.